In July 1863, Governor Zebulon Vance officially ordered breastworks and gun emplacements to be built around Raleigh. Construction on certain defensive positions at strategic points around the capital city had begun several months before. But citizen concerns over recent federal raids in nearby towns added urgency to the effort. Black laborers, mostly enslaved men, built the bulk of the walls and entrenchments that would circle the city. Cannon emplacements were set about every 300 yards. The works were designed to protect two railroad depots and other important structures in Raleigh. Despite the defensive ring around the city, Raleigh would be surrendered without a fight when Union General William T. Sherman approached in April 1865. Remnants of the earthen walls can still be seen in certain areas of the capital. <laughs>